California JD to Bs. My name is Maddie and I'm the Grand Bethel Senior Custodian and today is National Bee Day. So I'll be showing you how you can make honeybee slime. So the ingredients you're going to be using to make honeybee slime are one cup of hot water, a third teaspoon of borax, 1.5 ounces of clear Elmer's glue, a quarter cup of room temperature water, two colors of food coloring, and I chose golden yellow and brown, You'll also need gold sequins, two colors of extra fine glitter. I chose light gold and tan and gold. And you'll also need bee button embellishments. And the supplies you'll be using to make the slime are two containers for mixing and one container for storing. In your first plastic container, you're gonna pour in your one cup of hot water. And you're going to mix in your third teaspoon of borax. And then we're going to leave this to sit. In your second plastic container, you're going to pour in your 1.5 ounces of clear glue. And your quarter cup of room temperature water. Then you're going to mix them together gently. Next, you're going to be pouring in your desired colors and amount of glitter. And then you'll mix them in. Next, you're going to be adding your gold sequins. And once again, you can use a desired amount. And then you'll stir them in just like the glitter. For this step, you're going to be adding your two colors of food coloring. Before you go crazy with the food coloring, just try to do one drop at a time and then add more as needed. So there's one drop of yellow, and here's one drop of my brown color. So I've noticed that mine is a little more brown than I would like, so I'm going to be adding one more drop of yellow. Once you have your desired honey color, you'll be adding your bee button embellishments. And again, these are optional, so you don't necessarily need to add the bees, but they just make it a little more fun. And again, you'll mix them right in. For this next step, you're going to be pouring your glue, glitter, sequins, and bee mixture into the water solution that we had mixed with the borax. You're going to start seeing it to glob up and stiffen, but be sure to not touch it for 30 seconds. After your 30 seconds are up, you're going to grab your slime mixture out of the borax. It's going to be sticky. <laughs> so be careful when you put it into your dry container that you're going to use for storing. Once it's in your container, you're going to have to start kneading it. After you've put your slime into your container jar and you're noticing it's not yet firm, you can add a little bit of your borax solution that you have left over right here. When you're all done with your slime, you'll need to store it in an airtight container. And there you have it, your honeybee slime for National Bee Day.